the diagnosis affect uh, the him and the family subsequently and in later life? Um, I believe that yeah, I wish now that I would have done more research about it um, at the you know at the time of that it was because I don't believe that he um, I really don't believe that he benefited from the medicine um, because I honestly believe that he would put it in his mouth and not swallow it and um, spit it out when I wasn't there. Um, he had um, issues at school. Um, you know, not, not bad issues. He was, um, you know, involved with um, the band and um, he loved, you know, at the time he loved being in the band and um, I do think that it helped, you know. Well, finally one day he came in and said, I don't want to take these pills anymore. And so we decided, my husband and I decided that if he didn't want to take them, it was his getting to be his choice and um, that we couldn't really stop him from, um, you know, taking him because he, you know, he was becoming of age and, and uh, he, he knew how he, how it made them feel. We didn't know, um, how they made him feel. Um, and then it finally became a joke with our family, well, with Craig and I, because, um, we, um, when he went to college, I said, so, Craig, what's the drug of choice at the, at the college that he went to? And he laughed and looked at me and said, Ridlin. And we both just, you know, it's just a joke between us because he hated the medicine so much and, and to take the medicine for as long as he did and then really not see any benefit was, you know, bad on my part. I should have, we should have changed changed her doctors or something to done do something different, I believe. So I don't think it helped at all. Do you think that having ADHD affected him in the in the long run? Like do you think it like do you think it was the correct diagnosis and do you think it was do you think it's affected him into adulthood? Well I I think it was the correct diagnosis maybe at the time. Um but he he was um also very immature at the time um, but then he, he grew up and when he grew up, he, it wasn't as prevalent as it was when he was, when he was younger. And he always wanted to be the center of attention, always wanted to be right there in the center of everything. It didn't matter what was going on. And so we always thought that that was part of it, but I believe that's just his, I believe that's just his, his demeanor and his personality and the way he is and um, it's proof that he got through college he got through grad school he got you know did all these things and has still continued to do all these things so it really obviously um, did not affect him in any bad way uh, some days I think that um, that he he could still take them if he wanted to but um, he obviously doesn't think that he needs them. He's an adult. He can make that choice.